Hi guys, this is Devon from Neptune Design and today I'm going to be showing you how to add users to your Google Ads account and I'm going to be taking you through the steps step by step just so that you don't get lost along the way. Okay, and for those of you who already have Google Ads set up and you're trying to add somebody with a non Gmail email address and you can't get it right. I'm also going to show you how to solve that problem. Okay, so before I start this tutorial, I'm going to assume that you already have a Google Ads account set up. If you do not have a Google Ads account set up, you can visit us at neptunedesign.co.za. I'll leave the link in the description below and we can help you out with that. Okay, so I'm in Google Ads. Some of you might have a different view. Um, I'm in the advanced Google Ads menu, but don't worry, the links that I'm going to go to are more or less all the same. Okay, so the first thing I want to do is I want to click on Tools and Settings, and then I'm going to go down to your Account Access. Okay, I'm going to click on Account Access, and it'll take me through to this menu over here. Now, when I'm in the screen, you'll see a blue circle with a plus sign on it that says add user so if you have a normal gmail user you'll be able to set the permissions so you can set it to email only that's where they only get notification emails and report or you could go for read only read only is just to grant them permission into the account so that they can see what's happening but not really change anything you could also go for standard standard would help you basically log in and do all of the normal functions that you can in Google Ads but it won't let you do any top level functions like for example add or remove accounts okay so I'm gonna just say admin and if I was to type a normal Gmail email account it would work no problem and we can stop the video now. So anyone who is just interested in adding somebody with Gmail onto your account, it's no problem, you can do it. But if I go for a custom domain, so for example, if I go devon at neptunedesign.co.za and I say send invitation, I'll get this error. It says the email address isn't um, an allowed domain. Okay, so how do we change that? How do we get around that? Okay. The first thing I want you to do is I want you to go to security settings and then I want you to go to allow domain and then I want you to add a domain and whatever your domain is. So for example, our domain is neptunedesign.co.za and if I say save, now whatever email address I add that has that domain at the end of it, it should be allowed in. So I'm going to go back to users, I'm going to say add, and I'm going to put myself as admin, and I'm just going to say Devon at Neptune Design, whoops, the spelling is off today, Neptune Design, and I'm going to say send invitation, and there we go, the invitation will go through, and obviously you'll go into your mailbox, you'll accept the invitation, invitation and then you'll be allowed to basically access and view the Google Ads account. Okay, so this has been Devon from Neptune Designs. If you guys are interested in linking your Google Ads or conversion tracking or Google Analytics, please subscribe to the channel or visit us at neptunedesign.co.za. Thank you very much.